So just a quick note on sewing this with this fabric in general, but sewing these side hems. Um, one of the things you'll find is this fabric likes to roll instead of lay flat. And if you pin, that will help you. But in between your pins, like I could lay this flat here and pin, but look, it's still going to roll. So go slow. Don't, you'll be tempted to pull on it. Don't pull on it. Because remember, again, the stretch will impact how it stitches. So try to keep it as relaxed as possible and let the feeder dogs down underneath the foot do the work of moving the fabric through. Um, the tempting part for when it rolls is just, I'll just follow this roll because it's already basically doing my job for me. But some places it'll have rolled barely at all and some places it'll have rolled a lot. And by the end, you'll just get this wonky seam that's no good for anybody. So just continue to stick your finger under, find the, find the seam, lay it back flat, and then sew to that part, stop, refind the seam, sew to that part. Um, okay, this is again where the ballpoint needle comes in super handy because it keeps it from bunching and um, snagging as you try to sew it because it's a stretch knit fabric. Okay, so that's just a quick tip on hemming. Um, there was something else I forgot to say. Oh, yes. Yeah. So the selvaged edge, um, which should be on the bottom and the top. It was on the bottom and the top of mine. I can't remember if it will be on the bottom and top of yours. Either way, if you're sewing on this selvaged edge, it's not very pretty to look at. Um, but what will, what is, makes it, what is nice about this is it's a nice guide. So, um, see these holes here already? You just can kind of fold it and like it keep, helps keep you really straight going along the seams. Okay. My finished cloak ended up being 60 inches long by like 44 inches, like the width of the bolt. Um, and you may find that yours is a different length. Um, when hemming the length, we'll do that last. If you want it, if you did it already, that's fine. Um, but if you find that your cape is longer than you want it to be, all you do is fold up the bottom hem and, until it's the length you want to be all the way across and sew it across. And then your cape is as long as you want it to be. Um... So I'm going to finish hemming the sides and then come back with the official part two of uh, the Kate video where we attach the this big piece to the hood piece.